Former Navy SEAL Trevor Maroshek put his life on the line to protect our country when he enlisted in the military after 9-11. And as he was fighting to save lives at home, his life was saved on more than one occasion by his special partner, a German shepherd named Chopper, that was part of the Navy SEAL dog program. The two are the subject of a new documentary that airs this month. We'll speak to Trevor and meet Chopper in just a moment. But first, their story. My name is Trevor Maroshek. I joined the service in 2002 to be a Navy SEAL. In that time frame, I was able to have the honor to be with my dog, Chopper, who's also now my SEAL dog. He's a true hero, and he saved my life and the life of other service members on the battlefield of Iraq and Afghanistan from IEDs and also thwarting ambushes from the Taliban. Today, Chopper continues to save my life off the battlefield. Now I run a nonprofit organization called the SEAL Dog Foundation, where we help wounded vets and service members acquire service dogs and emotional support dogs. Chopper's also my own therapy dog, and he's the best thing that I have going for me dealing with post-traumatic stress, anxiety, battle stress, and a traumatic brain injury. Chopper's really a part of me, and he's always there for me. And now he sits at home with me and hangs out with my family and helps me raise my newborn baby, Sasha. And it's really hard to describe the relationship and the companionship. But for me, aside from helping me out and being my partner downrange and in the battlefield, he also showed me how to love again and showed me what true companionship is. And I really hope to express that and help other service members and wounded warriors acquire that same companionship and hopefully find that love with themselves and their family. Oh man, Trevor yeah. Chopper. Good morning, good both. Morning. Good morning. How's it going, you guys? Great. What a great story. First of all, Sasha is adorable. Thank what a beautiful you. little Thank girl. You. Yes, she is. <laughs> Tell me about the bond you have with Chopper now, after war, but also during war. Well, um, during war, I mean, he was a uh, him and I are tools for the military, and we actually, uh, you know, he saved a lot of lives, especially mine. And um, you know, coming out of the battlefield as well too, as I was, as you know, the military life came to an abrupt stop. Um, he really helped me with the transition as well. Also, that's how I met my wife. Hey, can I pet your dog? Yeah. <laughs> really trick. I nice. love that. Well, yeah. he's great. And we were talking about the, the dangers that you face in France, a part of the raid there. Um, Diesel, the canine dog, yeah. which was at its um, owner's side, died uh, in the raid. And this is serious business. I mean, these dogs are an extension of you, and they face danger just as you do. Yeah. Yeah, and actually, I'd just like to say, too, uh, God bless America and New York City and uh, especially what's happened in France, too. And my, my, our heart was broken, especially for the handler after seeing what happened to that dog as well, too. But, mm. you know, that's, that is the, 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 I wouldn't say the consequence, but the honor to be able to uh, provide that kind of a service and sometimes pay the ultimate price. So and now you want to take the great experience you've had with your dog and give it to other people with the Seal Dog Foundation. What do you want to tell other veterans who may need a dog like this? Well, the only thing is, I, I guess, you know, having the companionship, learning how to love again. I mean, I have a lot of friends who are dealing with post-traumatic stress. I mean, again, you know, for, for every, I speak for everybody that being in the service and being able to, you know, defend America was probably by far our greatest life's honor. Mm. But, you know, coming to an abrupt stop, and trying to learn how to deal with life on life's terms in the civilian world is very difficult for a lot of guys, especially if you're dealing with injuries. Therefore, you know, you know, what only thing I can do is share my experience and some of the suffering that I've been through. But what's really cushioned that ride is, you know, having my companion that I was very blessed to be able to retire him, but moving forward was able to start a nonprofit that actually helps other wounded veterans have assistance dogs, emotional support dogs, and companionships. It really helps with the families as well, too. Chopper's a special dog. Thank yeah. you for all you've done Thank for this for country and service. continue to do yes. for this country. Thanks, sir. Trevor, Chopper. We'll get you Thank some you pizza, sir. Chopper. We hear he loves pizza. <laughs> Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.